Hi, this is Jeffrey, and today I wanted to show you my new computer that I just purchased. Yes, my new computer. This is the HP Envy TE02-0042. It's an Amazon-only special. It's a very high-powered computer. It has an Intel i9-12900 processor, an RTX 3070 yeah, RTX 3070 graphics card, and one terabyte SSD storage. So this looks like a very, very powerful computer. Now, I bought this because I wanted to replace my current desktop, which is seven years old. I mean, it still works, but it's starting to, you know, give me some issues, and I really wanted to update the graphics in it. So... You know, I didn't, and I really didn't want to spend money uh, upgrading that old computer, putting more memory in it, or uh, putting in uh, a new graphics card. I just didn't want to, you know, spend the money on such an old computer. So I saw this HP Envy uh, on Amazon. It's an Amazon only special, and it looks like it could be a very, very nice computer. It's part of HP's redesigned uh, Envy line. It has a whole brand new case. And so let's get started in looking at this really, really, hopefully very nice computer. Okay, so I just took the computer out of the box and here it is. So this is a very minimalist uh, type of design. Uh, the case seems to be all metal. As you can see, there are vents throughout most of the top and the HP logo on the front and the word NV on the side. So looking at the top of the computer, you have going from left to right, uh, a microphone input, a headphone input, a card reader. I believe this is a three-in-one card reader. I know it reads SD cards. I'm not too sure what the other two types are. There's a power button. There's a USB-C port and three... USB-A ports, and I think they are all USB uh, 3, I think 3.2 ports, all super speeds. So here's the back of the computer. Uh, there's three audio ports, four USB-A ports, three USB-C ports, an Ethernet port, an HDMI port on the graphics card, and three display ports on the graphics card. Now, from what I understand, this computer does not have uh, onboard graphics. That's why there's no extra uh, display ports or HDMI ports on the motherboard. It's only on the graphics card that you see the, dis the display out ports. Now, in addition to my desktop, I also have this laptop that I bought a year ago. This is an MSI GE66 Raider. It's a gaming computer, and it is absolutely fantastic. Now, I don't game. I bought this to do video editing and other productivity tasks. Uh, this computer is just, it's, it's phenomenal. Uh, what's really, really great about it is that it has a 4K OLED screen, and that screen is just absolutely terrific. And, you know, I wanted a desktop that can match the performance of this uh, desktop because the desktop I'll be using a lot for uh, work at home tasks, uh, maybe some ed video editing. Uh, so I wanted a computer that could match this and hopefully that new computer will even exceed uh, this laptop. But I just wanted to show you this because this is just a fantastic laptop. The computer also comes with a wired keyboard and a wired mouse, but I'm not going to be using it for the computer because I have a much better uh, gaming keyboard that I've had for a number of years already that's of excellent, excellent quality. So this keyboard and mouse, I will be using it for another setup. And so here is the computer it replaces. This is the Dell uh, i7-6700, it has 8 gigabytes of RAM, uh, I believe it has a GT730 graphics card. So this is my Dell from 2016 that the new HP is replacing.
Okay, so here's the computer all set up, and I've been using it for a couple of days already, and so far it's been pretty nice. So let me show you the rest of this setup here. So you see the keyboard and the monitor. Now the monitor is, I, I recently purchased this monitor. It's a 27-inch Innocent INN OCN brand monitor, 27-inch 4K. Uh, I got this on Amazon. They had a very good price a few weeks back. I was using it with the older computer until I got this one. And so far, it's been pretty nice. Uh, I like it a lot. It's connected through the display port from the computer to the display port on the back of the monitor. Uh, the monitor also has an HDMI and a USB-C import uh, video port. And so it's been it's been really, really nice. Both this monitor and the computer have been working together very, very, very nicely. Uh, the keyboard here, that's an old keyboard I bought back in 2017, but it is an absolutely fantastic keyboard. Uh, the brand is, I think, IIIP. That's what it says on it. I bought this from Monoprice. They had a special sale. This keyboard is built like a tank. I mean, it is just incredibly heavy. Oh, and there it goes. It's going into sleep mode. This Keyboard is just absolutely fantastic. It's blue switches, uh, Cherry MX, and it's of a of like the highest quality type of keyboard. Uh, I tried to look this up and see if I can purchase another one for my other computer, but nope, I could not find it unfortunately. Uh, but overall, I really like this computer so far. It's it's been working pretty well for me. The last couple of days at least. Uh, of course, only time will tell whether or not uh, it works out over the long term. But so far, I'm pretty satisfied, satisfied that I purchased this computer. So I just wanted to give a few final thoughts on this new HP NV computer. Now, you really have to wonder, who is this computer targeted for? because it has the hardware of a gaming computer as well as a workstation. Now, gaming computers, they rely on very strong graphic cards. Uh, you're going to need a card that's at least an RTX 3050, 3060 at least to be a good gaming computer today. This one has an RTX 3070, so it's a mid-range graphics card. Now, Graphic com uh, Now, gaming computers, while they rely on their graphics card for their power, they don't really need the highest level processors. Uh, many, ga many gaming computers have an i5 processor, but this computer has an i9 processor, which is basically sort of overkill for a gaming computer. Uh, and even for, you know, typical everyday tasks, an i9 is uh, a little bit more than what you would need. So it's kind of interesting that this computer is basically a workstation and a gaming computer combined. So it's both, yet it's really neither. So it's interesting that this computer is basically targeted to everybody. Gamers, uh, people who do a very, very technical you know, type of work uh, that may involve uh, large computations, spreadsheets, all kinds of things like that. So, all in all, I think this is a really, really nice computer. I like it a lot. Uh, the design is very understated. There are no uh, LED lights on the, you know, on the side, on on the front, on the top. There, there is just none, uh, except for the power button. The par the power button uh, has an LED in it. Now, I think it would have been maybe nicer if. Uh, the word Envy was lit up with LEDs, or maybe the HP on the front, the logo, was lit up with LEDs, but hey, what can you do? That's how it is. But overall, I like this computer, so if you're in the market for a new desktop, you should you know, possibly consider this, the HP Envy TE 
802-0042 from Amazon. And as always, thank you for watching and have a great day. Bye.